According to reports, TJ Holmes has had so many affairs which led to his failed marriage. At some point, his wife was blamed for being the cause of their failed relationship. He also accused her of cheating because she had been silent about her ex-husband's extramarital affairs for a long time. However, TJ Holmes' estranged wife finally speaks about his affair. What did she have to say? Let's get right in. Multiple sources tell us that Holmes has had a series of relationships while married to his wife, Marilee Fevig. T.T. Holmes is an alleged serial cheater. The couple whose marriage hit rock bottom after 12 years of marriage sure gave off few signs via cryptic posts and comments. Holmes sparked rumors he and Fevig had split in April 2022 when he shared a cryptic quote from his dressing room on Instagram that read, end the relationship and cry once. It's better than being with them and crying daily. He captioned the post, quote of the week with a crying face emoji. Holmes deleted his Instagram in November 2022 after news broke of his and his Good Morning America co-host Amy Robach's alleged affair. Vivig's Instagram has since been private. Just before TJ's cheating scandal came out on Thanksgiving, Holmes's estranged wife shared a cryptic post that read, The advice I give my daughter most often, find yourself a sisterhood village in this life. Merrily continued, when your cup runneth empty, pay will be there to fill it over and over, or throw the content of the cup at whomever if the need arises. Beyond thankful for you at Stephalanth and at I am to say, love you hashtag happy Thanksgiving. Although Merrily's account is now private, her followers can see that she edited the post after originally writing it. It is sweet that she got support from women who understood her plight. She also got the support of Al's wife, Deborah, who is part of the ABC News family. Deborah commented on a few red heart emojis on her post. When the news about her husband's affair came out publicly, Merrily was beyond devastated. A source told Page Six on December 2, 2022, that Fevig was blindsided by Holmes and Robach's affair. The insider explained that Holmes and Fevig had been separated for six months but were still trying to figure and work things out when news broke of her husband and his co-anchor's romance. The insider claimed that the lawyer is devastated, surprising how she did not have the slightest idea. She felt she could have figured it out since they were trying to work things out. They were just together for TJ's 47th birthday, which was on August 19, 2022. The source also added that while Phoebe had stopped wearing her wedding ring since news of her husband's affair and has also gone ahead to make her Instagram private, Sources have it that his affair with his co-worker isn't the first time Holmes is cheating on his ex-wife despite their beautiful relationship timeline. There are several cases where TJ has been spotted gushing over his wife and how beautiful their marriage was. Holmes and Phoebe got married in 2010. They share one child, daughter Sabine, although Holmes is also the father of two children, daughter Brianna and son Jaden, from his marriage to ex-wife, Amy Ferson. In an essay for The Root in 2014 in honor of his and Phoebe's fourth wedding anniversary, Holmes wrote about how he became a better person as a result of his marriage to Phoebe. He said, I, like many other men, thought that I wanted to reach a certain level of success before marriage. You know, make the right amount of money, get the right job, the right car, the right crib, etc., and perhaps sow the royal oats, he wrote at the time. Now, I firmly believe the success we seek can come to a lot quicker, with a partner helping along the way. Believe me, my ego is as big as anyone's, but recognizing my deficiencies, admitting to myself that I need help, and accepting that help have all been critical to our success. We're only on year no four, but I shudder to think of the kind of man I might be if I wasn't married these past four years. Apart from being a supportive wife to TJ Holmes, Marilee also has quite a lot of achievements to her name. Even before she got married, she started building a career as an immigration lawyer. She practices in the state of Georgia and the state New York, according to Justia. She graduated from Vanderbilt University Law School. Vivig is also the chief diversity office for the nonprofit organization Save the Children, where she's worked since June 2021. According to an interview with Vanguard Law Magazine in 2019, Vivig was hired as a lawyer for Wilhelmina International Incorporated in 2017. She went on to become the company's vice president of operation and general counsel, where she worked as an immigration lawyer to smooth the immigration process for young people to work in environments free from exploitation, harassment, and other forms of a bee. As of then, Holmes had told the magazine, I credit the company for recognizing the importance of a woman's point of view in upper management. As a woman, I think I have a natural empathy for them models and can provide a unique perspective.
I fully embrace that part of who I am. Holmes' estranged wife has always been known for fighting and speaking up for people, especially women. No one knows the story surrounding how Holmes and Fevig met, but the duo got married in March 2010, three years after his divorce from his first wife, Amy Ferson. Their fourth anniversary was the highlight of their relationship. Holmes had written an essay about his marriage to Fevig and compared it to his marriage to Ferson, his ex-wife. Holmes also honored Fevig in a Facebook post for their 10th anniversary in 2020. This particular hashtag Decada challenge is a little late, but 10 years ago, Marilee Fevig married me. And despite my best efforts, she remained married to me for the past 10 years. That's not hyperbole. I'm not being dramatic. I gave her plenty of reasons, excuses, and opportunities to walk her fine ass out the door. But instead, with her built-in black woman superpower, she showed grace and patience that's incomprehensible," he wrote. Asking her for another 10 years would be asking too much. Another 10 months? That may even be a stretch. If she gave me another 10 weeks, I should consider myself lucky. If she puts up with me another 10 days, I'd be grateful. But if she would even spare another 10 minutes of her time for me today, I should consider myself blessed. He continued, This is M A R I L E E F I E V I G Holmes, y'all, and I, T J Holmes, do solemnly swear that I was he are. Even with the lovey dovey display, you could tell that for so many years they were together, the TV host had cheated quite a several times and merrily kept forgiving. Holmes cheated on Phoebe with at least two women at ABC News, including a three-year affair with Mary Good Morning America producer Natasha Singh that started in 2016. A source also told the site that Singh and Holmes, who were both close friends with Robach, would confide in her about the affair. Amy was the person they went to talk to about their affair and marriages, the insider said. Another source, however, denied that Robach knew of the affair until it was almost over. She didn't know about the affair until it was in its final stages. They told her about it right at the end, the insider said. The lawyer found out about her husband's affair in 2019 after discovering emails between Holmes and Singh. A source also claimed that Phoebe's focus on Singh was why she never thought Robach would also cheat on Holmes. Marilee never considered Amy because she was focused on Natasha. She never thought about him cheating with Amy because they were friends. Amy's daughter was their daughter's babysitter, the insider said. Holmes ended his affair with Singh soon after Fevig found out, and the two worked on reconciling their marriage. While still trying to reconcile their marriage, something annoyed Marilee. A source had revealed to Page Six that Fevig was upset that Rogak remained friends with Singh after Holmes ended their affair. She would see photos of them on Instagram and she didn't understand how their friend and her husband's co-host could remain friends with the woman who tried to break up their marriage, the insider said. The insider also explained that Robak and Singh's friendship ended around the spring of 2022 because Robak was so close to TJ. Phoebe was not suspicious of Robak until the summer of 2022 after noticing that she and Holmes seemed closer than other colleagues after having random meetings throughout the day and going to the bar for drinks after work. Holmes and Fevig were still together then and it was while celebrating his birthday in the Bahamas that she discovered a birthday card from Robach that seemed too personal for co-workers. Right there and then the trust she had for him was no longer there again. That's all for today guys. What do you think about TJ Holmes' multiple affairs? What effect do you think his affairs would have on Marilee Fevig? Do you think they would ever reconcile? Let us know what you think in the comment section below. And if by now you haven't, ensure you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new updates from us.